Hey guys, it's Rian, and today I'm going to be sharing with you some new beauty products. I received all these things in the mail, um, and so I thought I would show them to you guys. Now, I have to tell you, I did shoot this one be once before, um, and I had unboxed everything, and it was like my first, you know, real unboxing, and then I found out that I didn't press record. So um, this is actually the second time I'm doing this. Um, but the spirit is the same, you know what I mean? Like I haven't used any of these products yet, but I do know what they look like on the inside and they have been unpackaged. Um, so I'm sorry about that. I, I I don't know, I've been doing this for over five years and I still don't really have it all together, do I? So anyway, let's go ahead and I'll show you guys some of these awesome new beauty products. The first products I wanna share with you are from Louboutin Beauty and um, they are from Christian Louboutin's beauty line. So this first product is called the Christian Louboutin Luby Bell Beauty Lip Oil and it's in red. And as you can see, it's in this amazingly luxe packaging. It's just so cool. Cool. Um, it has the little mermaid scales on the bottom, followed by some studs and then a crown at the top. And what makes this packaging even more fun is that it comes with this ribbon that you can tie and so you could wear it as like a pendant necklace if you wanted to as well. So I just popped a little bit on. It gives a hint of the red color. And because it's a lip oil, it also has a bunch of benefits. So it really smooths and softens the skin of the lips. Um, and it says it has a jojoba oil base for the ultimate pampering experience. It's super lightweight and sheer and perfect for just adding a little injection of luxuriousness into your day to day. Um, and I just absolutely love this whole thing. The whole thing is just amazing to me. <laughs> Next product is the Louboutin um, Lash Amplifying Lacquer. So this is a mascara. The packaging is so substantial and luxurious. I mean, this has a serious weight to it. But what makes this so unique is that it is Louboutin Red. And I just absolutely love that. I don't have any red mascara, um, but I just love the idea of having a pair of Louboutin heels on with the red soles and then having lashes that are that same color. Um, I can not wait for my next trip to Las Vegas because this has Vegas written all over it for me. Um, I just think a black smoky eye with the red lashes would be such a bold, impactful look and I love that so much. I'm incredibly excited about these new Louboutin beauty products. The next products are from Givenchy Beauty and this is the Dahlia Divine Eau de Perfume Nude. I love the bottle. It's luxurious and yet minimalist. This is 100% my new scent and I am so incredibly picky when it comes to scents and smells. Um, and so when I got this in the mail, I was full, fully expecting to not really like it that much. Um, but it is a floral with an underlying musk, which my favorite scent that I wear every day is Flower Bomb by Victor and Rolf. And it's that same florally musky scent. So when I smelled this, I was like, oh my goodness. I love this scent so much. It smells very sophisticated to me. Um, and I, I, yeah, this is my new scent. I can't believe it, but it is. <laughs> Next from Givenchy, I have the Le Rouge. And this is in the shade Corail Backstage. And it is a beautiful coral color. But what I thought was so interesting and cool about this lipstick um, was that the bullet is covered in genuine leather, which I just thought was so cool. The top has the Givenchy emblem on it. It says Givenchy on the side with a little stud right here. Um, and you just pop it off and this beautiful coral color comes out. Again, the Givenchy logo is embossed in the side. I mean, this is what you want when you think of um, prestige cosmetics. Um, and I just thought this would be such a fun color for spring. I'm not usually a coral girl, but I'm, I really wanna give it another chance because I just, I want it to work so badly. Sometimes I don't think it looks that good on my skin tone, but I have high hopes for this one, so we'll have to see. These next two products are from Dior, and of course, I absolutely love Dior makeup. Um, the first is the Dior Addict Lacquer Stick, and this is in the color 420 underground and actually last year I had the amazing opportunity to go to the launch party of this product so as you can see it comes in the really cool Christian Dior packaging and then when you slide this off it's in this awesome almost brown but like a dusty kind of brownish rosy color I think this color is just so cool it's so dusty and a little bit grunge um, but it still has that rose kind of hue to it too so it's sophisticated it's that perfect marriage of all of those things um, and not to mention 
Dior, Dior lipsticks just smell fantastic. Um, so I'm really excited to wear this. This is super 90s, I love it. Um, yes. Next we have the Dior Skin Nude Air Luminizer and this is essentially a highlighting powder. I love the way Dior approaches cosmetics. They always champion the natural sort of look and that's something that I definitely, um, you know, kind of gravitate more towards. So this one is in the shade 004 and it's very much like a brownish kind of pearlized color. It's perfect, especially if you have a tan. I cannot wait to be super tan this summer and just to do my lashes and my brows and swipe on a ton of this highlighter powder because I, that is just the look I wish I could have year round. The compact also comes with this little velvet case that has the Christian Dior um, symbol on it and then it also comes with a Christian Dior kabuki brush. If you have been here with me on this channel since the very beginning, you would know that I love Urban Decay. It was the first beauty company that I kind of discovered by myself as opposed to like having my mom or my aunt show me about it. And some of my first videos were a series of videos on how to do looks with the Naked and Naked 2 palettes. And I have those palettes, I have the Naked Basics, I have the Naked Basics 2 palette. I mean, I'm just a huge Urban Decay fan. Um, so I was so excited to get these products in the mail. Um, so the first ones I'm going to show you are the new Hi-Fi Shine Ultra Cushion Lip Glosses. And as you can see, they come in this really, really cool box. Um, so I'm just gonna open this up and show it to you guys because they were nice enough to send over a bunch of these lip glosses all in this really cute packaging. And I am so excited about these glosses. Um, and also, there are so many here, I probably will not use all of these up, especially not within the next year. So a bunch of these will also be going into the little giveaway area that I have have been collecting products in. Um, so some of these will be in that giveaway as well. They also sent over some of their famous 24 seven glide on eye pencils. Um, and they sent it in zero, which is black demolition, which is a sort of a brown color roach, which is a little bit of a, like a terracotta color alkaline, which is like an eggplant color and heartless, which is like a, I don't know, it's like holographic, it's amazing. Um, so I'm really excited about these as well. So Urban Decay has a line of lipsticks and they are called the Vice Lipsticks. And this one is in the shade Backtalk, which is a bestseller for them. And so it performed so well that they decided to do an entire palette sort of inspired by Backtalk. So the idea behind the Backtalk palette was to make it really easy to do a monochromatic makeup look. Um, so you can use your Backtalk Vice lipstick and then in here you have the shadows um, to do an eye look. And then on the other side are the blushes in coordinating shades. So you have everything you need to do a really great monochromatic look. The last product Urban Decay was nice enough to send over is the Urban Decay Naked Petite Heat. And I am so excited about this. As I said, I am such a huge fangirl of the Naked palettes. Um, so I'm really, really excited about this one. So this palette has a bunch of orangish reddish tones um, and these are all matte and it looks like this one is sort of a shimmer color. Um, but I am so excited to dig into this palette. I can't wait. The last products I want to show you guys today are from Smashbox and they sent this beautiful holographic box over and it says, new look, who dis? So they sent over this super generous package to publicize that they have changed their packaging. And I'm so excited because I use the photo finish primer every single day and I actually just started trying out the primerizer as well. Um, and so I'm just so excited to get more primer because I need it, let me tell you. Um, but the ones that I'm really interested in trying now are definitely this primer stick, which I haven't tried in the past. And also I'm really interested in this primer water. Um, so I absolutely love these primers so much and they have a new look, so check it out. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. As I mentioned, there'll be a huge beauty giveaway happening very soon. So if you'd like to be notified about that, don't forget to subscribe and I will definitely also post about it on my Instagram. So you should definitely go and follow me on there. It's at Rianne Star. Thank you so much for watching and I'll talk to you very soon. Bye guys.